Hey, this is Dragon Feather, and this is yet another video of me answering your guys' questions. Um, so I will just get started and start answering your questions. So, all right, the next person who answered a question was I actually can't pronounce your name, so I'll put it on the screen. And is and this person asked, "Is there life in the universe?" I believe, well, besides us, obviously, I believe there is life in the universe, um, pretty much everywhere, because pretty much every star you see, scientists have discovered that there's a solar system around it, like our own, um, and if we're one planet that has life in one solar system, if you could only imagine that the location of the planets around the sun, and if it had the right properties, you know, for life that could be created, it would be, and it would be fine in my opinion. So I believe there's many, many, many other places in the world that has life. If so, are they here? Well, besides humans, if they're referring to extraterrestrials, I believe that we very could, that we very well could be living around other like aliens I guess you could say, like other species that are disguised as humans that are here or something. Yeah, sure, I believe that. Um, annoying noises. Um, anyway, another thing is that I also believe we could not be native to this planet. Um, it's just something that I think is a possibility that we ourselves could be an alien race dropped off here by other um, extraterrestrials. There's certain evidence that um, are certain things that have been found that have led some people to believe that we were genetically engineered to mine gold for other alien races, but that's something totally different than I believe what your question was, so I won't get into that. And if you think yes to both of these questions, what do you think they are? I suppose I don't have any, I don't know who they are or what they are, if you're asking me to describe what they look like. Um, I'm not sure. They could look like how we portray them in our movies, or they could look a lot like us, or they could be totally different altogether. So I'm, I'm not too sure about that. Um, I don't really know. So yeah. The next person is Q Angie or Q Ange one um, Sorry if that's not how you pronounce it. Um, and they asked, if spirits, angels, or guardian angels exist constantly around us, is there no privacy for humans? Um, when I got this question, I was like, hmm, that's an interesting question. And then I really, like, was pondering it for a second. I was like, hmm, I'm not sure. But I guess if they constantly exist all around us, being that we have spirit guides and guides and stuff like that that are, like, you can access, like, their help wherever you are, really, then, yeah, I guess we really don't have, hu like, don't have privacy if you think of it that way. Um... I guess, I mean, you know, if spirits are just floating in and out of the house and you're changing, I guess, no, you don't have privacy. Or if you're just, like, you know, chilling out on your couch, you think you're alone, but you're not, but really someone's there, but you don't know, I guess. So, I mean, I'm sure there's points in time when there's no spirits really around, unless they're constantly around us, like you asked in your um, question, but I don't really know. Um, but now, I th now, now I'm all paranoid what spirits are watching me. They're silently judging me or laughing or something. Um, the next person is... I, I don't think I can pronounce your name either. I'm sorry. Um, and the first question is, one, have you ever kicked him a guy... Have you ever kicked a guy in the balls before? They... Okay, this person sent me some really awkward questions, and I said I'd answer awkward questions, so I'm going to answer these because I said I would. Um, so, have I ever kicked a guy in the balls before? Yes, I'm pretty sure what guy has, what girl or guy hasn't ever done that in their lifetime. Um, so, yes I have. And part of it, I do regret it because I feel bad, and other times I'm just like, wow, that, that jerk really deserved that. Um, number two, what happened, what did he say? Well, I don't know if you mean what happened before or after the fact, but one time... This guy was, like, being really, really, really rude to me. Like, he was being, like, males are superior to females because we're dominant or whatever, that crap. And because of that, I, then I kicked him, and he didn't say anything. He just moaned and ran away crying after that. Um, and then the next time, there I have a friend who I don't, like, 
it's a weird relationship me and my friend have and he was just being stupid and stupid and annoying and I kicked him and I put him on the ground and I was like, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to do that. And um, his friends were laughing, but yeah. Um, number three is if a random guy you don't know came up to you in the mall parking lot and said, I'm doing a video for YouTube and I bet you $20 you can't put me on the ground by kicking me in the balls. What would I do? Um, I'd be like, I, I need to see the money before I do anything. Um, and if they were asking for it, then, and they were doing a YouTube video, sure, why not? I, I suppose I wouldn't mind. Um, I, it depend. it also depends who I'm with, if I was asked. Um, if I was with, like, my parents or my adults, like, my, my adults, that's funny, like, my adult, like, friends, like, not really friends, but, like, guardians or, like, siblings or just someone who's adult that I'm with, um, no, I probably would say, um, no, but if I was with my friends, I'd be like, yeah, put them up, man, so, it just depends, I guess, on the situation. Um, number four is, would you kick him and how hard would you do it? Um, yes, I would kick him, um, and how hard I would do it. I suppose if it was a bet and I, if I was going to get money, like, and he literally, like, here's the 20 bucks, and he literally showed me and, like, had his friends tell me or whatever, um, I absolutely would do it. And I would do it as hard as I could if I was going to get paid for it. Um, and be on YouTube, that's pretty fancy. Um, but... Yeah, I I would try my hardest to earn my 20 bucks, I guess, although I don't really know why anyone would be, um, like, I'm gonna kick you, or blah blah blah, blah or like, you wanna kick me? Sure, I'll pay you if you could put me on the ground, um, but I was like, alright, alright, and I'd probably also do it because I've put in a guy on the ground, I've put in a guy on the ground from kicking him in the balls before, and... I don't even know why I'm answering these questions. That's really weird. Um, and five, would you be afraid to hurt him? Um, pr no. No, if, if, he if he literally asked for it, I would not be afraid to hurt him. Um, if I did, I'd be like, cool, but I would just really hope, like, cool, 20 bucks, you know. But if, like, I did really hurt him after I put him on the ground, I'd probably help him up and be like, sorry, but where's my 20 bucks person, friend, thing, or something like that, and, um, yeah, I, I mean, I guess at first I might be like, I don't want to hurt you, but I think after, like, I, like, got up the courage, I wouldn't care, and I'd just do it as hard as I could, so, yeah, um, those were some interesting questions, uh, thank you for the questions, by the way, please keep sending me them, if you have any, um, on anything, like I said. Um, I will just be doing these periodically if I get more questions or if I have enough to make a full video. Um, but yeah, that's all for this one. And until next time, blessed be and bye!